So I recently saw this image, and it's probably a video as well, floating around the internet, and I thought I could replicate it using my 3D printer at home. It turned out pretty good, and I actually got there pretty quick, faster than I expected. So I jumped onto ChatGPT and just wrote out some generic content to a question that I might have my students answer in class. Came out pretty quick, and I thought, I'll just put that into Tinkercad, copy-paste, and unfortunately, it didn't really work too well because Tinkercad wouldn't let me put as much uh, text as I wanted. Uh, so I had to think about how else I might do it. So I made the text smaller and thought maybe I could copy and paste multiple lines. But then I realized that Tinkercad will stay on the same X height or the same height. So it won't really work. So I found a new software called 3D Writer and played around with that, pasting in my text and found out that I just had to press enter quite a few times. So you could uh, delineate the text and I could play around with different fonts, handwriting, and as long as I got the settings right, I could actually make this work with my 3D printer. You'll notice the settings on the left-hand side. With the bed, we have an x-coordinate value of 160. That just means 16 centimeters left to right, and a y value meaning 23.5 centimeters top to bottom. Our offset is how far from the left-hand side we're gonna start for the x value, and the y value is how far we are from the top. Really important is to make sure the pen goes up and down and that's one of the benefits of using this software is that the pen will go up and down between each letter. You can change the travel speed and if you actually have a look at the G code, you can see this, we've got our speed, we've got the Z value being four when it starts and then dropping down to 0.2 and those big chunks of code are really just each letter, which I thought was quite fascinating. And the other thing I had to do was change the setting to make sure the filament detection was off because we don't have any filament going. I sticky taped my pen, did a pretty quick job and it actually worked really well. I had to make sure the height was correct, so I had to fix it up once or twice, but once it started, um, I was quite impressed by the results. I then let it run. It took about 11 minutes to finish this amount of uh, writing. I'm sure you could probably change the speed and make it work even better but overall, I was quite impressed. And I must admit, if you look nice and close, it's really good, and my cat was also impressed. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think you'd actually use this, or do you think it's just more effort than it's worth? Thanks for watching.